Hey guys, welcome back to RJ Medley. It's Riley here and today is Mask It Monday. Okay, so the face mask that I am going to be doing today, I got this at Target and it is the Pure Milk One Pack Face Mask. Um, I believe the brand is uh, Pew or something like that. I believe it's French. Um, but it's just like a normal sheet mask. It just looks like a milk, which is really weird because I believe the only face masks I've ever had have come out of like a tube. Um, it's like a normal square sheet mask or a circle. So I'm really excited about this, even though I know it's just the packaging, which I really love. Um, so I got it at Target for, I think it was like $1.99 maybe. It only came out to be $2. Um, so I thought it was going to be like 5 maybe, but pretty happy for this. So let's get into the video. Okay, to start this off, you are going to need like a headband to keep your hair back. And I also have this like little facial rag. Um, yes, I am wearing turtle earrings in case you haven't figured that out. Okay, so up here it says it is hydrating. Um, it also says it in, I don't really know, I think it might be green or some sort. Um, but in other language, just so you guys know, um, it says air pocket sheet right here and it has a little picture and it says pure milk. So just like any other face mask, well, cheat mask, you wash your face up, make sure you don't have any makeup on because that kind of just ruins the point if you do. Um, and you just peel it apart, put it on your face, wait a couple minutes, and then take it off. It says a glass of milk for the skin. Okay, so it says it moistures the skin. Um, it supports moisture and um, it forms a protective barrier over the skin. It says there's air pockets in the fabric, hold essence, which enhances the absorption whatever, of active ingredients by the skin and yeah, it helps your skin be shiny. <laughs> Some set up. Anyways, so let's open this up. It's like, it's so cute and I just love the packaging. Like so far, I give it an A plus on this packaging. This is adorable. Um, I actually, this time I got this from Target because at my Walmart, I've like tried all the face masks that they have so far. So I was kind of just like, Anyways, so you just open it up right here. Sheet mask is like way down here. Oh, I got it. Hallelujah. Okay. <laughs> so it's like this folded up white square like most face masks unless they're the last video that I filmed. So you should go check that out because that one was white but it had color changing stars. Um, so yeah, you should check out the rest of our videos on this channel. Um, we are trying to get to 60 subscribers. Right now we have 59, so let's get one more subscriber, please. <laughs> okay, so after struggling to unfold this, here we go. I'm gonna try to put this on. <laughs> going to try. I love sheet masks better because it's kind of like easier but sometimes it's hard to try to make it fit on your face correctly and it kind of gets everywhere if you don't like move it to the right space so there's pros and cons oh my god it's so cold but really soft too i can just see my eyebrows and they're just like jacked up but you know <laughs> okay so it's kind of like the tiniest bit big down here but that's okay because it just goes onto my neck and that's fine. Okay, so I'm just gonna rub it in the tiniest bit. Make sure everything is covered. Okay, face mask on. Um, so it says to wait for 20 minutes. This stuff is really soft. It smells good. Like. I can't tell the scent, but it smells pretty good. Okay, so. Love this. It's really cold. Like, actually, it's it's like slightly warming up. It's kind of like room temperature for me right now. I love it. They need, do they have neon sheet masks? Because that would be so cool. But I like that it's white, obviously, because milk. 
But let's see what it looks like when we're done. I'm going to go set a timer for 20 minutes. Okay guys, so I set the timer for 20 minutes and I want to tell you, so most face masks are like ice cold, okay? This one is literally warm. You know how in my videos I'm like, somewhere there must be a warm face mask. This one feels warm to me, okay? So I guess I finally found it from my preference. But anyways, it's really soft and like kind of sticky, but I love the smell. I love how they make face masks smell like candy and like things. This kind of smells like, I don't know. It, I can't put a name to it, but it smells pretty good. Um, so I really like this because I did like a pre face mask face mask yesterday and I mixed some I made like my own little scrub type of thing and I have this too so if you guys just have a good like skincare routine you'll have some pretty good skin okay um <laughs> and drink water and exercise all and eat right okay just all these things that help you get good skin just some tips Anyways, <laughs> um, it's like, I have a mirror over here just in case you're wondering what I'm staring at. It's also like dark around me because it's dark outside, so we didn't have a, like proper lighting, so we have a flashlight, and that's what gives us our good lighting or decent-ish lighting today, folks. Okay, I, I think this was a pretty good price face mask. So this is my like story. So we went around to like three or four different stores hunting for face masks because the Walmart that I'm at, I've tried all the ones that they have out and they haven't like made, like gotten new ones yet. So, so after we, we came from Walmart, we're like, where else could we go? Tons of people um, have face masks, obviously. We didn't go to Ulta or Sephora or something like that. Um, next we tried, what was it? Five Below because I know that they, have a lot of face masks there, but I didn't find exactly what I was looking for. Um, so yeah, but, and then I was like, wait, the tar the targets in my area just renewed. So they updated their makeup section and got, got like a whole bunch of new stuff and all their like furniture and stuff turned white and then the floor is gray. So it's super pretty and like aesthetic, but they also have new items. So they had this gigantic table filled with so many different types of sheet masks. Um, there's a beetroot one that I wanted that was shaped like a mason jar, but I really like this one because I just really like the way that it looks. Minus the top. Because <laughs> it's so cute and it's like a milk jug. So yeah. That was my story of how I found this face mask. Um, also, the, the one thing about the sheet mask is that they could be too big, but they can also be too small. That's one of the only reasons that I really... Some, sometimes like clay mask or like other mask besides sheet mask because then you could like put it on according to your face. Um, with sheet mask, it's kind of just wherever it fits. And something I don't like about sheet mask is that to me, for me, it always does this thing where it just flaps up right here. It's kind of weird. But otherwise, I like sheet mask better than clay mask and stuff. It keeps falling off. Either that or I keep pulling it down. Another thing about sheet masks is that they do this foldy thing. Ooh, I should try like a bubble sheet mask at some point. Anyways, prepare for the next Mask of Monday to be fall related. Um, I wanted to start doing fall things in the beginning of October, but I was like, you know what? Let's wait till like maybe the 20 something so that it's closer to Halloween and it's more festive. Um, I didn't want to do it early in the month because I personally wasn't really in the like super fall spirit yet, so right now I'm doing this and I can't wait till Christmas time because that means I can do Christmas face mask. But anyways, next next mask it Monday will be fall themed. Also, I got I just got these new headbands and they're like super stretchy. I have to pull it more, but you know. Um they are really stretchy though. So I recommend getting those. This is falling down. I got them from the Dollar Tree because I didn't want to spend a lot of money on just getting headbands and, and the only one I had the only one I had was the sparkly white and gold one that I usually tend to wear a lot so yeah but I love these turtle earrings I've had these like forever they were my sisters at first but I thought they would go cute with this vibe of you know blues and gold and white and like light green and pink you know aesthetic 
Anyway, so it says to slowly moisturize it into your skin. Like just rub it in a little bit. So that's what I'm going to do, especially around my nose area because it doesn't like fold over. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna keep rubbing my skin like this. I wish I had one of those little jade roller things that are green and they roll because those would be kind of easier, but you know. A little under eye right there. Okay, so I'm just gonna moisturize this in. Our Instagram is rjm 4 extraordinary um, the, It's spelled R-J-M, number four, X-T-R-N-D-N-R-Y. We took out all the um, vowels, I think, yeah. Anyways, and then River has a TikTok, and it's called, it, well, on TikTok, it says it girl. So like it girl underscore, which is a little line on the bottom, chill. So it girl underscore chill on TikTok and RJM for extraordinary on Instagram. And obviously, since you are watching this video, our YouTube is R J Medley. R and J and M are all capitalized. There's a space between R and J and Medley. <laughs> Let's get to 60 subscribers. Okay, I have a question for you guys. If you do try out face masks or just really like doing face masks, what is something that you really like? What is your favorite one that you've ever tried or made yourself? If there's a recipe, you can comment that. Um, if it's just a name or a certain brand that you really like, you can comment that too. Comment down below. Six more minutes left on the timer. Okay, so we're just waiting for the timer right now. It is on two minutes. Um, I'm not going to say what I'm going to be for Halloween, and you don't have to say what you're going to be for Halloween. Um, but I want you to comment down below, if you, if you want to, um, some good Halloween costume ideas. If you celebrate Halloween, um, if you have a big party, or if you just go out and trick-or-treat, if you trick-or-treat at all, if you eat cake, or do you get candy. Um, another question is, what is your favorite color combination? I think mine is purple, silver, and black. I love those three colors. I think they're super pretty and they remind me of space. Comment down below what yours are. One more question because I kind of like just like talking to you guys, asking you questions. Um, did you go to homecoming this year? Um, I didn't personally go to homecoming yet or like this year, but my older sister Rihanna did. Um, you've guys seen her in vlogs and like other videos if you've watched them. Um, she went to homecoming in this pretty, like, navy blue dress and these silver heels and curly hair, and it's really pretty, and the homecoming that she went to was themed Wizard of Oz, and her color, like, went with it, and it was super cute. Um, maybe if you're in Canada, or if you just celebrate Canada holidays, happy Canadian Thanksgiving. Okay, so I can start... Like, I can feel that the outside mask is getting a little drier, which is how you know it's going to be done soon. So I'm going to go see what the timer is on. Timer went off. Okay, so the timer went off, which means it's time to take this off. Okay, so with these, I start at the edges, and I just fan it out, and I kind of just peel up. Just a warning, my eyebrows are going to be, like, totally messed up, but, you know. Gonna make them look like watering. Anyways, <laughs> so this is skin before I moisturize. Okay, that was probably like the worst ever, but you know. Um, so this is what the face mask looks like after I used it. Um, it is a single use, so I'm just gonna shove it over there. <laughs> um, just so you know, this package is recycling and. This mask is not tested on animals. So to get the rest of this little gunk that's in here, like the creamy, sticky stuff, it says to moisturize it into your skin. So I'm just going to squeeze the package together, which I hope I don't do too much because it also will break. Look at it, it's like... Okay, so I got like a bunch. Sorry, little mouth package guy. Kind of crinkle, but... I'll unbend him. So this is how much I got. I don't know how well you can see that. Eh, that's worse. Okay. 
I'm just gonna rub it through my hand and rub it on my face. Oh yes, so soft. Anyways, it comes with some moisturizer skin. I am putting it on my neck a little bit because it was already on there because of the face mask. Make sure you get under your eyes. Super wanna rub this in. <laughs> Anyways, so just keep rubbing that in for a little bit. Okay, so after I rub that in, um, one thing I don't get with these face masks is that it always says not to wash it off. It just says to rub it in and then leave it alone. I guess they assume you're going to bed or something because like my face is super sticky, so I don't want it to be sticky. So that is where my handy dandy washcloth comes in. I'm just going to wet it like where this wet splotch is and just wipe off my face <laughs> super easy like that but you know you gotta do it so um i just um this is hot water because i wet it before i filmed this but you know so always make sure that you wash off your face with warm or hot water you know like as hot as you can stand because that opens your pores and clears them out and then you finish off with cold water cold water because it closes up your pores and make sure that dirt doesn't get back in. So, hot water, cold water. Make sure you just get all of your face and right here in between your ears because face mask usually gets there, no matter if it's a sheet mask or just regular mask. And then dry with the dry side. Okay, my skin is like super soft and I just love like putting on a face mask and then washing it off and then just having the softest skin. So, um, I have like acne on my forehead and on my chin and on my cheeks and like a lot of places. So I like my T-zone obviously. So, um, if you are trying to get for acne that's on your chest, you could actually use the like the little glop that's in there and just... But anyways, I really like this face mask. Like for this price, like $1.99, pretty much $2, is like a pretty good price for this. I personally thought it was going to be 3 4 or like maybe $5 even because some face masks are 3 4 have been $5. But you know. Um, this was super handy. I'm going to scrunch it. So, um, Apu, I believe. Um, if that's not how you pronounce it, just is French, I believe, so I'm just gonna believe things now. Anyways, <laughs> this was the Pure Milk One Pack Face Mask. I, th I English, please. I got this from Target for $1.99, basically two bucks. Two bucks, two bucks, two dollar bills, you know. I wish I still had a two dollar bill. Anyways, <laughs> um, simple face mask just like this, but this was a pretty good price for a really good face mask. I, I like that it was white kind of because it's milk. It leave my I lift my skin so like shiny even though I know that's like a flashlight but you know super shiny and just I loved it. It's like super soft and I feel ready to go to bed because it is dark. I don't know what time it is. Let's see. It is 7.45 right now so my bedtime is like 9 but you know I still gotta eat dinner and stuff which we made it like 6 but anyways. Anyways, with all of that being said, I hope you guys like this video. Prepare for next time to be fall themed, kind of Halloweenish, just a little bit. Um, I really hope you guys like this video. The video, the face mask that we used in this video was of Hue, I believe. Um, little milk carton face mask that I got from Target. I already said that, but I just love saying that. I got it from Target. Okay, it's it's from Target. Okay, you got it. You got it. If you guys remember, um, I want you to comment down below if my skin looks any different from the beginning. Um, and if you use this face mask that I got from Target, <laughs> that you would get from Target or wherever else they sell these things, um, if your skin changes after that. So here's it up close. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Make sure you subscribe. Let's get to 60 subscribers, guys. 
that's one more subscriber till 60, okay? So let's please do that. Um, we have Instagram, which I mentioned earlier. It's also going to be in the description. Um, also a TikTok plus YouTube, obviously. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Chicken leg. And keep watching RJ Medley.